हेलो स्टूडेंट्स लेट्स फाइंड द क्यूब रूट ऑफ वन लैख फिफ्टी सेवन थाउजेंड फोर हंड्रेड एंड सिक्सटी फोर यूजिंग प्राइम फैक्टराइजेशन मेथड सो फॉर फाइंडिंग द क्यूब रूट वी आर फर्स्ट गोइंग टू डिवाइड दिस नंबर वन लैख फिफ्टी सेवन थाउजेंड फोर हंड्रेड एंड सिक्सटी फोर बाई प्राइम नंबर्स एंड विल फाइंड इट्स फैक्टर्स सो एज इट इज एन इवन नंबर लेट्स डिवाइडेड बाई टू टू टाइम्स सेवन इज फोर्टीन वन इज रिमेंडर दिस बिकम सेवनटीन टू टाइम्स एट इज सिक्सटीन वन इज रिमेंडर This becomes fourteen. Two times seven is fourteen. Two times three is six, and two times two is four. Again, we are going to divide it by two. Two times three is six. One is remainder. This becomes eighteen. Two times nine is eighteen. Two times three is six. One is remainder. This becomes thirteen. Two times six is twelve. One is remainder. This becomes twelve, and two times six is twelve. Again, we are going to divide it by two. Two times one is two. One is remainder. This becomes nineteen. Two times nine is eighteen. One is remainder. This becomes thirteen. Two times six is twelve. One is remainder. This becomes sixteen. Two times eight is sixteen, and two times three is six. Now we got an odd number. Let's divide it by three. Three, three times six is eighteen. One is remainder. This becomes sixteen. Three times five is fifteen. Again, one is remainder. The next number becomes eighteen. Three times six is eighteen, and three times one is three. Again, we are going to divide it by three. Three times two is six. Three times one is three. Two is remainder. This becomes twenty-six. Three times eight is twenty-four. Again, two is remainder. This becomes twenty-one. And three times seven is twenty-one. Again, we can divide it by three. Three times seven is twenty-one. Three times two is six. Two is remainder. This becomes twenty-seven. And three times nine is twenty-seven. Three times two is six. One is remainder. This becomes twelve. Three times four is twelve. And three times three is nine. Three times eight is twenty-four. Three times one is three. Three times two is six. Two is remainder. This becomes twenty-one. Three times seven is twenty-one. Now three times th nine is twenty-seven. Three times three is nine, and three times one is three. So our number is fully divided. Let us write this number in terms of its factors. Now we have written all the factors of one lakh fifty-seven thousand four hundred and sixty-four. To find the cube root of this number, we are going to take cube root on both the sides. So this will be cube root of one lakh fifty seven thousand four hundred and sixty four equals. Let's write all these number in terms of cube. So we'll take three numbers together. So this is going to be two cube, then this is three cube, three cube and three cube. That's two cube times three cube times three cube. Times three cube. Now all these number are in cube and they are under the cube root sign. This cube and cube root will get cancel out and all the numbers will come out of the cube root sign. So this is going to be two times three times three times three. This is the cube root of one lakh fifty seven thousand four hundred and sixty four. Or the cube root of one lakh fifty seven thousand four hundred and sixty four equals two times three is six. Six times three is eighteen, and eighteen times three is fifty four. So the cube root of one lakh fifty seven thousand four hundred and sixty four is fifty four. So this is how we find the cube root of any number. I hope this video is helpful to you. If you like the video, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more math videos. Thanks for watching.